Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mimi and I'm so happy that you're here. Today I am doing my weekly grocery haul. This week I did go to Ralph's and Trader Joe's, which are my two stops every single weekend. Um, so we're just gonna jump right in and get started because I've got quite a bit to go through. I'm gonna go ahead and get started with Trader Joe's just because I have only two bags, but they are pretty cool. So we're gonna start with this one. Um, first I picked up some Persian cucumbers. I picked up some microgreens. And this is one of my favorite snacks, the peanut butter pretzel nuggets, love those. And these I picked up to just munch on. Throughout and the then day. I grabbed this for lunch today, which is a Caesar salad with some chicken. I picked up some more of the frozen chicken breast. We ate this last week um, in a Caesar salad. I just put these in the oven, cut them up, put them in the Caesar salad, delicious. And I picked up, this is new for me. This is the first time we are going to be trying this. I have two nights out of the week that's coming up where I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to cook dinner. Um, and the thing is when I don't cook dinner, we tend to not have food for lunch because I make enough to take to lunch for the next day. So I picked these up for one of those nights. One of those nights I'm gonna have to figure out what to do. But it looked really good. This is the first time I'm trying them, so I don't know if they're good. Let me know if you've tried them. This is the Mandarin style orange chicken bowl. I just picked up two, um, one for me and one for my husband for lunch this week. So let's see, let's see if it's good. And then I picked up, these are just staples to keep in the freezer. I like to just have these in there, um, you know, again, for nights where I don't cook dinner, we don't have lunch. So I just picked up some chicken nuggets and I picked up some turkey corn dogs. Um, you would think a kid lives here, but no, it's just us. Last item in here is just some string cheese and this is in the Colby Jack. Then moving on, I bought these last week and they were so good. I had to pick them up again. These are the cinnamon roll drizzle granola. These are so good. They literally taste like just little Cinnabons. They're so good. We just eat a couple, like we eat a handful of them or I'll separate a couple and put them in our lunch just to have something sweet um, to have for lunch. And these are delicious. These are so good. If you have kids, these will be a hit. Um, I picked up some organic baby spinach, some butter lettuce for some salads I wanna try to make this week. I love this salad. This is one of those prepared ones already that comes with everything in it. This is the broccoli and kale slaw. So good, so, so good. Then I picked up some organic creamy mushrooms, grabbed some more of the teeny tiny avocados. Then I grabbed one of the Caesar, the Caesar salad kits. Um, that's what the butter lettuce, lettuce is for. I remove these things. See that I remove these things out of here because my husband hates them so I remove those and then I just add more butter lettuce but I use the croutons and then I add chicken to this and it's a great great dinner and I grabbed some arugula last two items I grabbed some blueberries and then of course the diced onions that was it for Trader Joe's I'm now gonna move on to Ralph's so I have four bags from Ralph's, but they are not full. So we're just gonna dive right in. So up first is some baby Swiss and these are so, so good. Get these, so, so good. Wraps, sandwiches, all of that, delicious. Have some more of our carb balance tortillas. I grabbed two of the oven roasted turkey breast. Get these every single week. So grabbed two of them. Then I grabbed, this is my favorite salsa to make with chicken inside of the crock pot. This is La Victoria um, Salsa Verde in medium. Putting this with a couple of chicken breasts in the crock pot, this is so, so good. And one thing I really like to do sometimes is just get a tortilla, put some cheese in it, and the chicken that was already made with the salsa is so, so good. So try that. I grabbed some, just some sugar-free jello swirls just to have in the fridge. And then I grabbed some more of our bread, the keto bread. Again, I cannot, cannot recommend this bread enough. If you are trying to just move over to a healthier type of bread, this is so good. It tastes like regular bread, really high in fiber. I cannot rave about this enough. This is so good. This is a staple in our house. Picked up some slightly salted rice cakes. And then I picked up a um, Star Kiss Light Tuna and Water. This is one that comes with four pouches. 
Um, you get a much better deal buying this at Walmart. Walmart sells a pack of eight of them and I wanna say it's for the exact same price. Um, I picked this up just because I, I don't have any more. I think I might have one left, but I do need to do a Walmart trip soon and I will be stocking up on those. So just a tidbit, um, buy these at Walmart if you can in the big pack, but if not, Ralph sells them too. And I think they're eight. 99 and I grabbed a big thing of light string cheese I like to just keep these in the fridge they're just good to snack on good to throw in for lunches I grabbed a heavy whipping cream I grabbed two of the Kroger hard-boiled eggs I grabbed two of those picked up some green onions a bag of grapes also we'll put these in the freezer and just like separate them in little pouches incredible snack if you can't tell, I'm a snacker. And some cilantro. I grabbed two limes and one lemon. I grabbed some tomatoes and I buy the tomatoes that are on the vine. I just personally prefer them that way. I feel like they last a lot longer. Um, so that's my favorite when they're on the vine. And down to the very last bag, I grabbed some organic bananas, some blackberries. Final item are some family size strawberries. Oh shoot, I forgot to grab to buy the the whipped cream. Dang. Oh well. This this week we're not going to have it with whipped cream, but giant thing of strawberries. That is my entire grocery haul this week. Cost me $80,000, of course, as you guys know, prices for groceries are just completely completely insane. Um, but yeah, if you guys like videos like this, please subscribe. I put these up on my channel every single week. Today is February the 4th and this will be up the same day. So I always post my hauls the exact same day that I go to purchase them. That way you can go to your stores and pick up the same items if you want them. If you guys have any questions at all in regards to meals or how it is that I use some of the items that I purchase, please let me know in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Thanks, bye.